Hi guys, Zombie Killer Gage here. Now today is the 19th of February and we're going to be discussing Fortnite patch 3.0.0. Now in this patch we'll be discussing the new and the old Battle Pass and we'll be discussing the Pump Shotgun. Now the first topic is going to be on the double pump. Now essentially what happens when you use a double pump is you have two pump shotguns and you can switch between either. And when you switch between them, as long as you have ammo, you are able to shoot it instantaneously after switching weapons. Now what's going to happen in this upcoming patch is essentially once you switch between weapons, if you switch back to a previous pump shotgun that's already been used, it will have to pump before you can fire it. So essentially the double pump technique will become obsolete. Now once this patch drops there are going to be so many people are happy and devastated that this double pump technique is gone. I myself am going to be devastated since I love using it but I know many others who are also going to be super excited about this drop because they hate the double pump technique. Down in the comment section below let me know if you're happy about this new update or if you're sad about this new update. Myself I know I'm going to be devastated that I can't use my double pump technique. Now next thing is on today's topic, we're going to be talking about the Battle Pass, both Season 2 and Season 3. So, let's get right into Season 2. First of all, Season 2's Battle Pass is being extended by an extra day. It was meant to be ending on the 3rd of this month, yes, that's right, Wednesday the 3rd. But now it's being ended on the 4th on the Thursday. So, you guys who haven't got that Black Knight yet, you can still get in with a chance of getting the Black Knight. Now this new Battle Pass, you will have to use V-Bucks to purchase it. You won't be able to purchase it with actual money, you will have to buy V-Bucks first and um, then buy the Battle Pass next. Now, for Season 3's Battle Pass, this Battle Pass will only be obtainable by purchasing V-Bucks and then purchasing the Battle Pass via the V-Bucks. So, this Battle Pass is only going to cost 950 V-Bucks and if you are like me and you saved the V-Bucks from the previous Battle Pass, you will be able to buy this new Battle Pass. So that's it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Now I hope you guys have a nice day and I'll catch you in the next video. Goodbye.